What is good, Twitter, YouTube? It is your friend Philly Fan from Sports Gambling Daily on YouTube. I'm back with another free video play once again in the KBO. Uh, yesterday was able to give you a winner, Sam Song Lions money line, along with a sprinkle of the run line. They were able to win that game nine to seven in a rain shortened game. Um, with that being said, I like another play tonight, and it's going to be in the Tigers Dinos game. You got Drew Rusinski going for the diet uh, for the Dinos. He's six and one with a two three eight ERA. You got Young Jong Yang going for the Tigers. He's uh, let me make sure I have this right. Five and four with a four point six seven. ERA, and I'm going to give you a few reasons why I really like the Dinos to bounce back tonight. Now, I, lo I know they lost yesterday, uh, but the reasons why I like them tonight is, Rusinski's great, he's been pitching great all year long, he just had a wonderful performance against the hard-hitting Bears lineup where he went seven innings, I think he's going to be able to limit this Tigers lineup, they only average about 3.8 runs per game on the road, not only that, the Dinos, they've only lost twice in a row, three times this year, and when coming off a loss, they are 12-3. and three. Now, the Dinos have a shitty bullpen, so as long as we can keep them out of it, I think they have a really fantastic um, way of winning this game. I think Rusinski is going to go 6 or 7, which is going to give us an opportunity to limit that bullpen, and then I like the Dinos' offense to take it on from there. Um, I like the fact that there's a lefty going for the uh, Tigers because that allows the Dinos to put their right-handed platoon lineup in. Aaron Altair is really starting to come into his own. He's an ex-Philly. I'm pretty familiar with him. But not only is he great in the outfield where he cuts off runs with his arms and his defense, he's starting to hit home runs. He's really good at the plate now. He hits gap to gap. When he gets on base, he steals bases. He's, he's on first, he's getting a second. If he's on second, he's getting a third. He's just disruptive. Um, and I expect them to be able to get to the Tigers pitcher tonight, put up a crooked number, and not only do I like them on the money line, I think this is another opportunity to sprinkle a little bit on the run line. Uh, the official play will be money line, but I, I would not hate the run line in this whatsoever. So that's where I'm going for July 4th. It's going to be the NC Dinos to win the game on the money line. Best of luck if you decide to tail. Let me know if you do. If you have any reasons why you don't like to play, let me know that as well. And uh, we'll go from there. Again, it's your friend, uh, Philly Fan Sports Gambling Daily on YouTube. Have a safe, happy holiday. Have a great 4th of July. Talk to you guys soon. Peace.